are here with Uncle Artie and Chewy Wombat Combat with yeah. an update from so the King is, County uh, Courthouse. Yeah, this is Chili Wombat with Uncle Artie and uh, I've got my Constitutional Scholar headphones on. So we're here for the uh, revocation of the deferred prosecution on Glenn's um, case from Bellevue where he got pepper sprayed at the, um, you know, at the riots and protests um, a couple of years oh, ago. I can't see! And it got continued again because they're going to wait for the outcome of the trial from the arrest at Muckle Teo Police Station. So that trial starts June 1st. Um, so this got continued until June 6th. Is that right, Teller? So um, nothing's going to happen on this until June 6th. And then I guess if he's guilty on the Muckle Teo Police Station arrests, I think that's um, that was trespass they got charged with eventually so if he's guilty on that they'll revoke the deferred prosecution on this and he'll go to trial for um for the bellevue case which was uh, obstruction of justice or disorder i think obstruction yeah what about the uh one where he got arrested for you know you can hear that you know pulling his finger like that at the office that has not been charged so he was arrested for that no charges have been filed um, for that, that was I think January 14, 14 out at the parking garage at Mukilteo. So he was arrested for that, but no charges have been filed. So they charge he was arrested. That was a Class C felony. They do have three years to charge a Class C felony. Um, if he ends up getting charged with a misdemeanor instead, um, they've got you know a year to charge for that. So my guess, this is just speculation, you know, based on my constitutional. Um, law headphones. Oh, yeah. Constitutional that, headphones. Mm, constitutional rights. That, that I don't think he'll get charged with felony harassment for that, but that's just my uninformed guess. I do have some documents to post that I received about that with some correspondence that were admitted into evidence between the two attorneys where they were trying to work out a plea deal for the Muckle Teal, and Glenn was not willing to sign a plea deal on those Muckle Teal cases. And the the January fourteenth case was discussed, and it doesn't sound like they are going okay, forward. Excuse me, I, I I gotta go follow some. I gotta go fraud at okay, somebody. Thank you, everybody. So, this is a uh, chilly wombat signing out, and we'll see you in court on Friday, April first, and we'll see if Glenn's there in Everett. Bye.